My name is Sajad Khan and I work for Daimler, which is one of the biggest manufacturer of passenger cars and commercial vehicles. We provide the mobility in different shapes and form to our customers. And we have the brands like Smart and Mercedes-Benz, which are offering different kinds of products in different segments. In the organization, I'm responsible for CASE, which is actually coming from the words connectivity, autonomous, shared, and electric. This new way of transportation, which we are used to today, has also brought in the last 130 years lots of challenges together with that one. With the invention of the gasoline engine and as well as the automobile, car bands and the Gottlieb Daimler, they not only change the way we transport from one place to another, in fact, they change the whole face of the world. It had brought us the congested cities. It has also brought some kind of a climate changes also, which we have got to know now. But from today's perspective, we have to make our new technologies more climate and environment friendly. At Daimler and Mercedes-Benz, we are tackling these new challenges in a way that we are engineering new kind of technologies in the form of artificial intelligence or powertrain, like for example, electrification and the fuel cell. And we are also transforming our talent pool in the way that we could answer in a best and the safer way for our customers with the new technologies, the new way of transportation. Let me give you a few examples to make it more tangible for you that okay, you can see what are the challenges and how we are answering them. So one of the most important thing is how do you find the right parking place in a safe way that okay and it should also reduce the time. What we have done for that thing is that we have built a special kind of a sensor systems in our vehicles which whenever you are driving on the street they not only collect the data from the street what kind of parking spots are free in fact they also send that thing back to the cloud to make it that data available to other vehicles also. And that thing you can see from our pilot projects, which we have done in Stuttgart as well as in Beijing, that you can just enter into the parking garage and you can leave your car over there and the car autonomously will drive and find its parking spot and will get parked over there. Another example could be the traffic. When you are in the traffic jam, our driver assistance system offers you the opportunity to make sure that you stay in the lane, any kind of a lane departure on the right or on the left hand side, in the same way, if you have your eyes off the road and somehow your car in front of you stops, then we our driver assistance packet, they apply the brake in such a way that you don't hit the, your car in the other things. We also have an option available that okay, if you want to overtake a car, it can also be done automatically. So what we are doing in this our driver assistance packet is just to make sure that while being in the traffic, no matter whatever the speed is, we offer different kind of a support systems to our customers that you can, they can drive the vehicle in a very excellent way while releasing the stress is still keeping very, very safe for our customers, which is the DNA of the Mercedes. In the same way, we know that okay, more and more cities are getting congested at the moment because lots of vehicles are coming to the city. For that thing also, with the Mercedes-Benz user experience, we have offered some kind of feature, we call it the private car sharing. That means that you can share the vehicles and you can drive. In addition to that one, we also have the car to go as a car sharing. If you don't want to use a car and you want to use another kind of a transportation, for example, the public transport, then we have a very nice offer available. We call it the Movo. So we have the different kind of a solutions available in a very holistic way for our customers to make sure that okay, they have a solution available which can reduce the congestions in the city. Now, the last one and the fourth one, environmental. We have two technologies which we are focusing very nicely and we are also bringing the products on the road. We have launched a vehicle based on the complete fuel cell and we have also announced the vehicle for the electrification which is the EQC that the customers will be able to have those kind of a car from our side under the brand Mercedes from now onward from this year. In addition to that we are working extremely hard to make sure that these technologies are being developed further 
and until 2022 we will have more than 130 different derivatives available for battery vehicle these are the technologies to bring them to our customers that's what excites me So the future gonna be mainly based on artificial intelligence and completely different kind of uh, powertrains we work on. We are also converting our ideas into products. We call them I2P. And from these ideas into products and services, we would like to excite our customers in a completely new ways, the similar way our forefathers like Gottlieb Daimler and Carl Benz, they created the car as an answer to the horse characters.